Have to wait at least another week now to find out whether the only suspect in a local mother's murder is mentally competent to stand trial. Action News Jack's Alicia Tarancon spoke with the missing woman's mother about the fight for justice. We spoke with Jolene Cummings' mother just outside the courthouse, and she said she was frustrated by the judge's decision. She was hoping to get more answers in her daughter's case. The courtroom was packed Thursday morning as Ann Johnson sat patiently, expecting to hear a ruling on her daughter's murder case. Jolene Cummings disappeared more than a year ago, and the sole suspect in her daughter's case, Kimberly Kessler, was charged with Jolene's murder. Kimberly Kessler was not in court today, and the judge ordered another hearing next week to determine Kessler's competency to stand trial. At this stage, I'm going through anger, you know, because you want answers. Action News Jax first told you in May that doctors claim Kessler was incompetent to stand trial based on their evaluation. State attorneys in Nassau County challenged that claim and requested a motion to have another doctor examine Kessler. After reviewing both evaluations from mental health experts, the judge ordered that Kessler be transported to court next week. Hopefully we'll get that verdict, whatever it is, and then we'll deal with it from there. Johnson says she went through her daughter's belongings last night. Where she always did the heart with her letter J. And pulled her daughter's pink book filled with Bible verses that she says helps give her and her family some peace as they wait for answers. We are a Christian family, and we just ask everybody else to stand with us. Stand for justice for Jolene. The judge told Action News Jax that Kessler's next hearing is scheduled for July 2nd. Reporting in Nassau County, Alicia Tarancon, CBS 47, Action News Jax.